Hello and welcome to the sixth tutorial in the CSS Basics tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to look at how to style a span tag. In the previous tutorial we looked at how to style the div tag, it's very similar. A span tag is also a inline element. This tutorial seems you've done tutorial one. If you haven't there'll be a link in the description to the source code and as usual there'll be a link in the description to the source code produced from this tutorial. I'm going to go ahead and open up a text editor and then open up the document from tutorial one. Now that it's open, it's going to enclose hello world in the span tag. Save that and go to index.css. We've already got some styling for the body tag which just sets the color to red, I mean the text color. And to just style a span tag, you just put span. Because it's a tag and an ID or attribute, you don't have to put dot or hash or anything like that. And then we're just going to set the color of it to blue. I'm just going to save that. Now we're just going to open the web page up in a text editor. And there we go, we've got it styled to blue. I'm just going to right click, inspect element, then we have a span tag. We've got the color blue to it, and it did inherit from the body tag the color red, but it was overridden by the span styling. That's all you need to do to style a span tag. It's literally the same as a div tag. The reason I created two videos was because div tag was a block level element, span was an inline element, and I've had a few people ask sometimes, is styling different in terms of the way you go about it in CSS for div and span? So I thought I'd create two separate videos. In the next tutorial, we're gonna look at how to set the font size. Uh, all the required links for the source code will be in the description. If you have any messages, feel free to, well, I mean, if you have any questions, feel free to message us. And thanks for watching.